Hi, I'm Catherine from Crime Psych. I am putting this video together to tell you about one of the courses which is available. At the moment, this particular course is only available in a live session. However, it will soon be available online as well if you can't get to one of my sessions. The course is called In the Mind of the Murderer and as the title suggests, we take an in-depth look at various murderers and the classifications of behaviours. So In the Mind of a Murderer course is designed to give you an understanding of murder and by the end of the course you'll have an understanding of the various types of murder and how they're defined. You'll gain an understanding of the reasons that drive people to murder, the roles of the offender and the roles of the victim. We'll also examine the various types of people who do murder. Throughout this course, case examples of murderers are used, given an overview of what they did and the psychology behind it. It is based on factual research and presented in a really understandable basic way so you don't need to have any prior knowledge or understanding of murder and the reasons behind it. The first section is called defining murder and that section covers what is meant by the term murder. It details the variation in murder definitions and what is meant by the terms spree, killings, mass killings, serial killers and single murders. It also covers the various contexts and interactions that can lead to murder. The next section takes a look at why do people murder and that section takes a look at the various justifications that people can give for murder. It details what factors might lead somebody to murder and the various driving forces that are behind it. Then we take a look at serial killers and that section tells you where the term serial killer comes from. It details how the FBI classifies serial killers. It covers the role of the perpetrator and of the victim. It also examines some of the behaviours in serial killings and how this escalates over time. And we also take a look at the likely characteristics of serial killers. The next section takes a look at psychopaths. And the section takes a look at psychopathic behaviour and how this is used to commit murder. It explains what a psychopath is and their characteristics. It covers how psychopathy is measured and how psychopaths manipulate their victims. The next section is on narratives. And that section talks about how we tell our life story. It explains how revealing murderers' behaviours can be. It covers how offenders see themselves carrying out the various roles within their life and the various roles of the victim. The next section talks about killer couples and that section talks about the psychological mechanisms that drive couples to offend, how behaviour escalates and is reinforced and rewarded within particular relationships. And then we look at children who kill. And that section of the course takes a look at the psychology of children who murder. It explains the likely characteristics and the background of child murderers. As I say, this course is only available at live events at the moment, but it will soon be available to do online if you can't get to me. So thanks for taking the time to watch it. I hope you'll enjoy the course. Bye for now.